You all may know my son, Pepitos, from his band, The Republic of Pepitos, as well as his role as Family Man on the reality TV show, The Republic of Pepitos, as well as the documentary on his life during World War II, titled The Republic of Pepitos. Did you know his father, like his father before him, has a story to tell as well? My name is Miguel, father of Pepitos, and this is my story. That is just a shame. Did you just crawl like a bird? You're not a bird. You get away from Miguel. Miguel has sharp things. Sharp things like this hammer. This hammer is very sharp. I beat you. Oh. I'm Miguel, father of Pepitos. You are not a. You are not undead. Though I will say one thing. I do like your hat. Yeah. I want your hat. You will give me your hat. Your friends will give me your hat. Because your hat is very nice. Actually, I may have picked up a couple of your hats. Let me check up on this. Okay, Miguel cannot wear... Um, hats of human skulls. That is okay. Rusted rat. With more meat. I like my sharp hammer. Okay, another one of these. Okay, fine. Break, pick. Okay, fine, break. What the... What is your problem? Why you no stay up? What? What is this? This is very much broken. You stay up, and I click, and then and then you're all like, "Ha oh, hi." There we go. Because apparently Miguel can't figure out how to work you, stupid chest. I do like your table here. What do you have? Poison of illness. Silk corn the cap. <gasps> Mortar and pestle. I take that. I also take your silk wraps in this thing. Yeah, why not? While I am rubbing this goblin with my sharp hammer of justice. Another one! You will enjoy my hammer of justice. What is this? What just happened? Miguel must take a moment to make flashy lights and think about maybe doing techno music. <laughs> okay, I don't have any more magic to do that. That is fine. Why would the goblins have this thing here? It makes uh, no sense. Hmm. Which way should Miguel go? I know how to figure this out. Whichever way the light shines, Miguel will go. If he can find his light, because for some reason his light is hiding from him. Okay, that did not work. Miguel is not very good at this. That is okay. There's another chest here. For some reason you work that time, but you know work the other times. This is... I know like you. But what is that? <gasps> Push the locks. Oh no! Watch out, goblins! No! I'm sorry. Please. Do not sue Miguel. He has a son. His son just made it to to Europe. Please. No sue. No sue. Oh, you're dead. Well, that is no problem then. Miguel will just unlock this ch Why you know what? Okay. I'm getting very sick of this. There. Stupid broken chests and they're not working with lockpicking sometimes. But working with lockpicking other times. Because why, why why would you bother working? It is like very hard to do. 
to just open up and be all like, oh, I'm a chest and ah! <laughs> Who are you? Why you come here? The girl will take your level leather shield along with your lockpick. Miguel will make it very nice things. <laughs> Alright, Miguel tires of this hammer. Let's see what else I got. Iron short sword. Oh! My torch is there! Hi, torch. I lit you hours ago, but you were apparently not working. Oh. Cut you, goblin. Oh. That is the sound that my sword makes. Why am I on fire? Oh, you want a magical battle. Unfortunately for you, I know no magics. Because magics are forbidden. You goblin witch. I think this game has bad translations though. You are clearly a goblin gypsy. Why you no leave Miguel alone? I have a son, I don't want to hunt you, I just want to leave. I've got a friend. He is in very much trouble. And I can't get to him with all these goblins running in my face. Oh, these rats were alive. I'm gonna make sure you don't tap. You don't deserve to. Instead, what I will do is I'm gonna take some stuff from this guy. <gasps> Goblin shaman stuff. I will take this. It is very much close to the Albanian gypsy staves of 1982. You see, I know these things because I am Miguel, father of Pepitos. I don't want to read up on all these tutorial things. Miguel does not appreciate the tutorial box keeping popping up in his face when he does not want the tutorial box to keep popping up in his face. It is very rude. So rude. It is like my friend, Shor Shinobi, mother of Beach Ninja. Who oh, yes. I am the friend of Beach Ninja's mother. I believe you all know them. And now, I should be free. Let us see how this works. No, I'm apparently still in dungeons. I hear voices. Glenroy! I return. You're not Glenroy. Glenroy, no! Fight! Fight to protect Glenroy! Take that. Glenroy. I'm so happy you're safe. You're moving your lips no, without speaking. He is not fine. one of them. He can help us. He must help us. They cannot understand why I trust you. They've not seen what I've seen. How can I explain? How do Listen, you manage? You know the Nine. How they guide our fates with an invisible hmm. hand. One thing that does not comply or make any sense in Miguel's mind is how Patrick Stewart manages to narrate within my own mind. It makes no sense. But let's see. Uh, last I checked, I gave birth to Pepito, so I'm not on good terms I've with I've served guns. the Nine all my days, and I chart my course by the cycles of the heavens. The skies are marked with numberless sparks, each a fire, and every one a sign. Oh, I know these <laughs> Patrick, stars you are well, such a romantic. And I wonder which sign marked your birth. Patrick, you, you make me blush. But that is okay. I am Miguel. I am father of Pepitos, after all. I'm just very, very much blushy right now. Oh, Miguel. Why? Why you... The signs I read show the end of my path. My death, a necessary end, will come when it will come. Oh, I know many things that will come, Patrick. You, you flatter me. Your stars are not mine. Today, the thief shall guide your steps on the road to destiny. The thief? Are you saying Miguel is a thief? 
Patrick. You were sitting there flirting with me for a while, but now you insult me. How dare you? Aren't you afraid no to die? No trophies of my triumphs precede me, but I have lived well, and my ghost shall rest easy. Men are but flesh and blood. They know their doom, but not the hour. But I am a lizard, In this, so I am not I am flesh blessed and blood. To I see am scales. The hour of my death. Scales and blood. To face my apportioned fate, then fall. Your fate is to fall. Uh, can you see my fate, Patrick? Because you, you flatter me, and then you insult me, and then you call me thief. It is, it is no nice. My dreams grant me no opinions of success. Their compass ventures not beyond the doors of death. But in your face, I behold the sun's companion. The dawn of Akatosh's bright glory may banish the coming darkness. Just to make sense, Akatosh with such is... Hope, and with the promise of your aid, computer, my heart right? must be satisfied. Where are we going, Patrick? I go to my grave. A tongue shriller than all the music calls me. You shall follow me yet for a while. Then we must part. Patrick, I don't want to part. You... You I may as you. well make yourself useful. Carry that torch and stick close. But I am already... This We're is the, the Emperor's blades. bodyguards. Our job is to get him out of situations like this. Although I admit, things are not going according to plan. But My job is to make sure the Emperor gets out of here alive, and I intend to do it. Why you continue talking to Miguel? Let's I don't... Close, so let us do our job. I don't talk to you. I want Glenroy. Glenroy! I love you, Glenroy. You are my best friend. You are the best friend. Of all best friends. Glenroy. Let us never die. Don't get in our way. Don't yell at me, Glenroy. Why you become Not so mean? And I, I understand that you are very upset by Patrick Stewart's immediate death. But that is okay. Because Glenroy, you and I, we were going to go to Europe together and we are going to do many things. My guardians are sworn to protect All these people! You get away from Glenroy and Patrick! One is my best friend, the other is my lover. Glenroy, I know see your health. I heal you? That does I'm I'm healing myself. Glenroy, I need to heal you. These people, they know the fake magics. Die, you Protect the Emperor. I see the light. It is okay, Glenroy. For some reason, they do not understand who is the Emperor. Because they run after us. We have an advantage. They don't understand us. But that is okay, because Patrick is their target, but they don't know who Patrick is. Hold Even though... I don't like this. Let me take a look. Glenroy. Glenroy, no! No, Glenroy! I can't let you go alone. I protect you. Looks clear. Come on. We are good We're friends. Through to the sewers. You and me, Glenroy. We're going to take on the stars. You with your sword, and me with my forbidden magic. Wish I covered myself. Damn it. The gate is barred from the other side. A trap! What about that side passage? Hmm. This window tells me the same thing, Glenroy. You are very good Worth at reading. Try. Let's go. What? What are we trying? What are we trying? Glenroy, you need to speak to me. I'm your good friend, Miguel, father of Pepitos. It's a dead end. What's your call, sir? I don't know. I don't see any good options here. They're behind us. Wait here, sire. Wait here with the Emperor. Guard him with your life. I can't For leave the Glenroy. Emperor! This one's mine. Glenroy, no. Don't leave me, Glenroy. I can go no further. You alone must stand against the Prince of Destruction and his mortal servants. He must not have the Amulet of Kings. But, but Take Patrick. the amulet. Give it to Joffrey. He alone knows where to find my last son. Find him, 
and close shut the jaws of oblivion. Okay, Patrick. I believe in you. You take care of Glenroy. Make sure- No! Patrick! You're supposed to protect Glenroy. He is the best of my friends. Farewell. I must leave. I must go find Patrick's son, who is going to be called Mepitos, son of Patrick Stewart. Is there's no key here? Okay. I clearly forgot something. Patrick, do you have a key? I failed. I failed. The blades are sworn to protect the Emperor. Now he and all his heirs are dead. Boris. You speak the lies. Amulet. Where's the amulet of kings? It wasn't on the emperor's body. Uh, the emperor Strange. gave it to me, Boris. He saw something in you, trusted you. They say it's the dragon blood that flows through the veins of every septum. They see more than lesser men. Well, of course, the I am covered in dragon blood because I am Miguel, father of Most Capitos. Think Do you not see my face? Crown, but that's just jewelry. The amulet has power. Only a true heir of the blood can wear it. They say. He must have given it to you for a reason. Did he say why? Because I am Miguel, father of Pepitos, and I must find his son, who is called uh, Mepitos, because Pepitos Joffrey, and Mepitos are best that? friends. Why? And Mepitos is going to go to Europe, and he's going to help Pepitos take down the Nazis, except Pepitos is working for the Nazis. Nothing I ever heard about, but Joffrey would be the one to know. He's the Grand Master of my order. Although you may not think so to meet him, he lives quietly as a monk at Wainan Priory, near the city of Coral. Oh, I like Priories. There are very nice people there. I know this one monk, his name was... I don't remember his name, but that is fine. So, uh, besides my story, Boris, nobody likes you. And I would like to get away from you, because you are not a very nice person, you are very mean, I don't like. And I'd like to know how to get to this priory. First, you need to get out of here. Through that oh, no door shit. must be the entrance to the sewers, past the locked gate. That's where we were heading. It's a secret way out of the Imperial City. Or it was supposed to be secret. Here, you'll need this key for the last door into the sewers. You're going to be sending me into the sewers? There are rats and goblins down there. But from what I've seen of you, I'm guessing you're an experienced monk. Am I right? No, I'm not a monk. I am... I am Miguel. I am father of Pepitos. It's just not going to work that way. For combat, I would like... Let's see, I would, I would like strength, perhaps. Maybe some endurance. Personality, maybe. Ah, uh, What? Hmm. I'll take personality over endurance and wait a minute. I see what you tried to do there. You tried to make me get very bad with the ladies. I need to endure with the ladies. It is what I do. My seven major skills. Well, uh, let's see. I'm a very good marksman. I am a lizard, so I'm good at illusion. I am very good at the sneaky sneak. Uh, I'm okay with the blade. I can buy na, na, na. I make armor? No, I don't make armor. I'm Miguel. I'm Father Pepitos. I'm good at acrobatics. It's what I do. Which makes I'm I'm also good with athletics. And light armor, I guess. And that is okay. My custom class will be called Miguel. Father. <laughs> that that Miguel. There we go. Yes. That class would be best class. Thank you. Really? I would never have guessed. Still, I don't think you'll have any trouble with rats and goblins. W wait to be a dick, Boris. This is why no one likes you. You must get the amulet to Joffrey. Take no chances, but proceed to Wayne in Priory immediately. Got it? I understand, Boris. Good. The Emperor's trust was well placed. What about you, Boris? What are you going to I'll do it now with that Glenroy is gone? And make sure no one follows you. You better get moving. May Talos guide you. Talos. By the way, thanks for recovering Captain Renault's sword. I'll see that it is given a place of honor in the halls of the Blades. 
I d I don't want to give you her sword. It it is my sword. I I just I don't want to. Oh, what is all this? There are quests and things, and I'm gonna go this way, Boris. Let me. Let me see. What is the fate of Glenroy? No, Glenroy. Why? Why you be dead? Why you dead, Glenroy? I'm going to miss you. You are my best of friends, Glenroy. I'm sorry about your passing. Boris. The king's body may be important to you. But again, Glenroy's body was important to me, damn it. You protect it. You protect it well. Don't be a dick, Boris. Don't be a dick. Oh, really? Another lock picking thing? Gonna have a teary eye ending. But that is okay. Because chests. Okay. Don't be a dick, Boris. Don't be a dick. And thus begins the chapter of Miguel. Father of Pepitos. Next time on Miguel. You, you stupid things. You fall on Miguel. Okay. Cat person. No! I did not mean to shoot you! No, cat person, no! Don't kill me, cat person. I no mean it. I'm journeying far and wide because my name's Miguel. And I hop over hills, and I go over- I'm struck- I'll get- Murder someone, the Dark Brotherhood comes to you in your sleep. It's how they recruit new members. Go on. Have you ever been interested in joining the Mages Guild? I thought about it when I was younger. I like that book. But some people really love them. What other books you got here? The Thief of Virtue, On Morrowind, Manual- <gasps> Morrowind. That is where my father. Yes. Well. Can I help you? Oh. <laughs>